welcome back to another slightly belated Lippies of the Week video. This one for a March 12th through 18th, or however the hell long it ends up taking me in reality. So anyway, we're gonna go check in on my progress of last week's picks, of which at least one I am very proud of my progress on, just saying. But anyway, let's go do the weigh-ins and see how all I did and show you what I'm rolling in for this week. So let's go. Okay, so starting off where we started last week, we have the perennial Eos Cranberry Pear, which is staying until it's gone. It was at 0 0.831 ounces last week, and it is now looking like this. We're getting it down. That one side's still higher, but, you know, <laughs> I think we've made nice progress, and it is still continuing to be smoothed over, so... Let's see where it currently is. Yes, I see it turned off. I'll turn it back on. So it was 0 0.831. It is now 0 0.823. All right. Not quite as much as I thought it would be, but still good. And I will go ahead and put that on the new fresh one, too. Is it two three? Yeah, two three. So then our Jade Matcha Tea Eos was at zero point seven seven six ounces and is now looking like this. I started swooping in on that side, so it's still high in the back. But again, nice progress, nice dips made on it. So let's see, weight-wise, how much of a dent did we put in? Oh, wow, okay, 0 0.766. Like a whole point ten in there. Or 0, point, or point zero 0.010, whatever. Then the Elf Brain Freeze Lip Gloss was at 0 0.561, and honestly, this one, I am very eager to see where we are now, because it is way down in there, and it did not look like that at the start of the week, so I'm really eager to see what it is weight-wise. I'm thinking maybe one more roll-in, at most two, this should be gone. So it is now at... 0 0.546, okay, that is what we like to see. There we go. Lovely, lovely progress. And then the Tower 28 Lip Jelly in Fire now has this much windowing in it, which I'm actually kind of shocked. Um, this was all the way full to the top when we started this week. So, I'm actually kind of shook, especially because I was having reservations at the start of the week thinking, did this go off? It smells kind of weird, but I also don't remember what it smelled like when I first opened it. Maybe it always smelled like that. I don't know for sure, so I'm keeping it in for now, but it was at 1.163 ounces when we started the week, and it is now at, oh, wow. Okay, so 1.143. Holy crap, that's the best progress we have seen in a while on a single one. I'm actually really, really impressed with that. Okay, so for this week, obviously we have this guy. We already wrote that down. I think we're bringing back in the Chapstick uh, Lip Oil in Peach Tea just because it felt so close to done last time that I really, really, really want the satisfaction of finishing it. So we are currently at 0 0.230 with it. And honestly, it feels like it's, like, maybe down to, like, probably around here. Like, there is not much left in it. I just want to polish this one off and get it gone before it goes bad. Because that one's been open a really long time. Probably longer than it should have been. So I really want to get that one finished before it has a chance to go off. Then we have the Merit Lip Oil in Marrakesh. I think we've only rolled this one in once so far, so it's still basically brand new. Uh, again, this is another one like the Tower 28 where I'm like, I can't remember, did it always smell like this? I don't know. 
it's not that it smells bad or anything, I'm just like, I can't remember if it always smelled like the way it does right now, so just in case, let's roll this in, especially since I've seen people in other Project Pan videos saying that this stuff does go off quickly, so this is another one I should be rolling in frequently. So for right now, it is at 1.02. Two four ounces, and we will see what kind of progress we can put on that bad boy. And then finally, this one just because I want to, because it's been a while since I started it and I'd like to get more use on it. The Dr. Bronner's Peppermint Organic Lip Balm. So it is basically, it's still brand new. It's only got that much down in it. So it is at 0.343. Ounces. So we will see. Oh, wait, actually, there's a hair on the scale. Does that change anything? Probably not, but let's get it off of there. <laughs> yeah, it's not enough to make a difference in the weight, but anyway, yes. So that is also in for this week. So that is where we're at progress wise for last week, as well as what the starting points are for this week. I feel really, really good about that progress. I'm just, again, shook it by how close to done I got this one just in that one week. Cause you guys saw this one. It was nowhere near that empty when I started the week. So I'm like, okay, this one is definitely doable. This is another one that's going in the short list of ones to roll in fairly soon to just try and get this one done. Because again, I'm not that attached to this one. I kind of honestly really don't feel it on this one. I kind of just want to get used up and rolled out and free up that space for something that I do feel more strongly about. But anyway, it's doable. You saw how quickly that went. Probably take one week, maybe two tops to get it totally squeaky clean. So, anyhow, what have you guys been using? What have you been loving? Have you finished anything lately? Leave all of that and anything about anything down below in the comments. And as always, you know what to do. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a like. If you're not already and you'd like to be, click subscribe, hit that notification bell icon so you never miss an upload. Leave comments down below. Make sure you're following my social media accounts, my Facebook fan page, my Twitter, my Instagram, my eBay, my Reddit, everything and more is all down below. And if you like what I do here on this channel and you'd like to help support it, the donation link, as always, is down in the description. Anyway, guys, till next time, see ya.